Hey, I'm Mahmoud. I'm Phil. Hi. And today we are going to be talking about the new Spirit Box single, as you can see on this uh, screen. Um, right now, you have been listening to Spirit Box a lot more than I have. Probably, yeah. I barely know them. Oh. Like, I, I know of them. I know that they have a female singer. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Courtney? Yep, Courtney. Indeed. Courtney Love Plant. And uh, there's this huge hype around them right now, and they have a new single out featuring Sam from Architects, who I am a big fan of. And they released an album? Yeah, I think their album released today. It's the first. It's their first album. It's insane, man. For were EPs mostly in singles. That's kind of insane to have that much hype around yourself in today's metal scene with only having like singles and EPs. True. I think it's got a lot to do with them being considered one of the boundary pushing bands, so to speak. Okay. Uh, what, what do you like about them? Like, what, what's what's your appeal? Uh, uh, what's, the what's their appeal on you? I think mostly their riffs, their use of tech specifically, that might be a guitar nerd thing, but they have multiple pitch automations in one song, oftentimes. Mm -hmm and incorporate elements in a, a very tasteful way, in my opinion. And Courtney's a beast. Okay, Courtney, Courtney's good. I, I, the, the stuff that I saw from her, or from them, was always impressive. It's just not what I'm into right now, but let's see if this song changes my opinion. Uh, let's just go. Let's go. Let's go, all right. tune low yeah man they tune <laughs> real low like is oh. that is, is that an eighth string uh, uh, i think he plays seven strings longer scale wait are you saying it's just one guitarist yeah Damn. I, I think it, uh, the last time the last time i checked i saw them live once and it was one dude and i think their probably standard tuning is g sharp or something or f sharp the new standard like is anyone playing standard anymore? Anywho, Probably. like, like, I love low tunings and I love the way this sounds. Like the mix is insane. Yeah, they have. That is some punch behind those tones behind everything. Very industrial. Yeah, Probably. I'm surprised at how at how I'm not gonna like Mansony. Mm, I I would have uh, or nine inch thought... naily. I don't know, like a lot Maybe. of electronic elements. I thought if Sam brought him over <laughs> from there, <laughs> I Sam? don't know though. What? Sam Carter. What industrial elements? In architects? In the last album? Oh well, I didn't listen to it that much. <laughs> Confession time, I guess. I didn't really like them. Man. <laughs> but... Here it fits, in my opinion. Oh, I mean, I love it. It sounds great. Fun and inspiring. That's dope. Okay, let, 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 let's continue. This is the shit that was missing from the last album. Yeah. From, for, for, from Architects. You... Why doesn't he do that? Why, Phil? I don't know. But you, you stopped at the very best time to stop before. 
Sorry, wait. Right. Let, let me rewind and, and let's continue. Sorry. I, I'm, no, 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 no. What? I don't know the song. I just mean you stopped right before Sam. Sam yeah, came. right before Sam started, I apparently stopped. Wow. Anywho, like, this is the kind of shit that I was hoping Sam would bring to no. No. to the latest Architects album. That, not that he's doing a bad job. Please don't misunderstand me. He's doing well and he's yeah. doing amazingly. Like, his vocals are impeccable. But I do miss that visceral. <laughs> Deep anger that he used to bring on the albums before. Yep. It's here. Like, I, obviously, he still can't do that. These are so distorted. Is that both of them? I actually don't know. Sounds like her and him together. I was more uh, paying attention to the wall of sound that seemed very electronic-y. And yeah. then I dig. That nah, sounds amazing. I just I just paid too attention to the vocals oh. right now. Let's listen again. <laughs> Is that legal? No. That's just that's but just straight great. up. That's just straight <laughs> up filthy. That was that was a dirty breakdown. And here, here's something that we talked about just a few minutes ago, uh -huh. where where I was talking about um, like polymeters and polyrhythms and mm -hmm. like, and I I have experimented with polymeters and polyrhythms alike, mm -hmm. and I found out that I just don't find them as fun as I think mm -hmm. they sound, because. Like, Meshuga does a lot of polymeter stuff and it sounds heavy as fuck. Oh. But then I try that and, well, obviously I'm not Meshuga. But... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but what I'm trying to say is it just doesn't feel as fun to me to play. Like, uh, a oh. chugging pattern like this where it's just like visceral and simple and heavy and dirty just seems so much more fun to me. Oh. And they nailed that. Mm -hmm. It was just simplicity, but... Turned up to 11, if that makes sense. Yep. That, that reminds me of what, uh, very weird uh, segue here, but what Girlfriend Reviews said about Doom. They focused only on the parts yes! that are fun. Yes, it's just like, <laughs> go blow up stuff. That's, that's it. it. Like, that's all of it. And you yes. don't need more than that. And I think, I think they are distilling what modern metal... Are they metal? Are they, are they considered metal core? Mm -hmm. Okay. What I'd modern metalcore should be, I think. Mm -hmm. No. Uh, let's continue. I think she's handling the the screaming. just ended yeah i mean did we want more from it we didn't need more from it 
I think I think it's a concise song. There's no filler. It just starts with a hit to the chest and fucking tries to decapitate you with the breakdown and then they leave. Yeah. Don't even buy you dinner afterwards. Dirty. Yet still. Dirty. Dirty. They they done us dirty. I I enjoyed that a lot. Yep. Same Z's. Um yeah, I think I think I should give them more I should I, I think I should listen more often to them and check them out. That was dope. Uh, yeah, I don't even know how to end this video right now. So I'm just gonna say that smashed. Yeah, that that was dope and uh, four and a half stakes to the face out of five. That's a good yeah. way to rate something. <laughs> I like okay. four and a half stakes to the face. More stakes to the good. face, please. If you got any songs that we should check out and we haven't seen them, and preferably their new songs, let us know down below in the comment section and we'll see you next time. Cheers. Cheers.